What do you think is harder? Living without a bathroom or building yourself a bathroom? And that look like this. Yikes. Um, some privacy? Let's find out. We tried to build this bathroom last week. We might have made a big mistake. Fingers crossed, we mixed the right bag. But here we are standing in an empty, colorful room once again. Sometimes other things take priority. Well, not today. We are dedicated to tackling this bathroom build. Great start! It's never easy breezy, beautiful construction. <laughs> I'm bringing the hose in here. No matter what it takes. All right, everyone, this is a shower. Pan. Pan. And I have a funny feeling it's gonna take us a long time. <laughs> I have a present for you. Beauty. Happy birthday. Now I've heard that these showers mm -hmm. are all very different and the instructions are very different. So you have to read the you instructions. You need to have patience. Let's see what this looks like. Well, we have progressed to reading the instructions inside of the bathroom, <laughs> which means we've made it far. Okay, so I have a few things here. How do we know for example, like you just put it right against the edge? Like, that's just a lot of questions. You are crossing so many bridges, but I think it might be no, important. No, it's so important. I like, know. because as soon as you do one thing on this, it's practically permanent. If you make a drain, you have a drain. If you put the mortar down, you've got mortar down. <laughs> like, you have to think about it. There's no going back. You're going up. You're going up. Huh? <laughs> what are you talking about? We are cleaning the garage. Is not attaching anything to the plywood. Let's just mark out the ring. Have we given up on the instructions? 4.40 p.m. I'm ready to cut the drain. Cool, almost okay. there. Okay, we have been doing research for this bathroom build for so long, but it really doesn't make complete sense until you put yourself in the game. Freezing! You're getting the pan! You're the hottest on the market And you're only getting started Look at this, everyone. A drain, minus the P-trap, but we'll get to that later. Very important, the cardboard. I had no idea. Every single time I've done a drain, which is a lot, I've thrown that piece of cardboard out, and it's very important because it's what allows the black ring not to bunch up. It's like a waxy cardboard ring. We're always like, why is this always bunching? You're my favorite, hands down, don't gotta explain it. This class, tell your mama that you made it. What did we get ourselves into? OMG. X D. Today we opened our eyes to a winter wonderland. The cabins never looked so beautiful. This is the exact reason we're excited to stay the winter. Good morning. Morning. We're gonna be doing something super exciting over the holidays. For the first time ever, we're going to be calling our subscribers on the phone. We're gonna call as many of you as possible in a full day. I cannot wait. I'm so excited. If you or someone you know would love to hear from us, all you need to do is make sure that you're subscribed. By the way, it's completely free and all you have to do is click right here. Leave any comment below and make sure you like the video. We realize the holidays are a great time to connect and show up for all of you. On December 20th, if you receive a comment back from us, you've been chosen for a phone call, so keep checking back in. Can't wait to phone y'all. Crystal isn't here as he ran out of mortar and she's gone to town to get more mortar. And there's something I want to show you all so much. Our friends just sent it to us in the mail and it has completely changed my life as well. Allowed me to keep all my fingers. This, it's amazing. Just wait, put this here. Ready? Normally, it doesn't take this long, I swear. It's because the camera's on. Well, this is really not going how I envisioned it. I promise it's cool. What the heck? This was going so well the other day. 
let's try this again with a different piece of wood. Wow, this is probably the worst demonstration I could have ever given this. Okay, I think this one's gonna go perfect. Oh. What the heck is this wood? Oh yeah. Highly recommend. I don't even know what it's called. Wood kindling maker? We can go with that. We make up every other name anyways. Just the sound of wood, eh? Like, listen to this. Give it a big whack. Boom! That looks like an Izzy toy. Goodness, someone missed their mom. My favorite thing is coming home to my girls. Oh, running at the truck for mama. Hey, love ya. I love ya. <laughs> okay, let's go. We got work to do, girl. Mom bear. All right, everyone, we are preparing the area for tile. This is a huge step. That means our whole house will be floored, and that is the beginning steps to the bathroom. With the shower pan and the tile down, it's gonna be a lot of exciting things to follow. What? I didn't make that connection. Yeah. Our whole house will be floored. Isn't that cool? We are going with a 32 inch shower pan and it fits perfect in our little tiny house bathroom. And it's gonna be quite nice because we've been showering all sorts of places. The deck, on the trampoline, the greenhouse, outside the van, the sauna. Wow, we have quite the shower spot. Can't there. wait to shower in here. I can't wait to there. It's going to be life changing. Our tile cutting station. Are we on tile cutting right now? Yeah, we are. No way. So exciting. Put your water in after you grab your cord, everyone. Great start. Great start. <laughs> this is the drip loop. So if you have your cord running down, the water runs down to the electrical components. Danger. So now it's up here. The water doesn't run up the cord. So this is called the drip loop. Because water can only run down. How'd you learn that? Instruction manual. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everyone. This is our beautiful bathroom tile. Yep. Stunning. I love it, do you love it? Oh yeah. What do we need to do, Crystal? Um, so I think we need to square out the room first is what I've learned. We're gonna square it out that, make sure, that way we make sure the first row is completely straight and square. Yeah. And then from there, it should be fairly easy. This room, probably not that square. By the looks of it. Because we're not very good, right? We're not so going directly five. to the wall. Just do many of those. Grab the level now. And so what we're gonna do is try and gauge how we'll put our tile down that we're going to measure to and from the tile to make sure that we are staying straight. The houses are allowed to be nine inches out of square. Random fact for you. We've gotten halfway through a tile. We haven't really got started at all and the hardware on one of the components on the saw is failing us. So we're going to remove it. Jocelyn's got a raincoat on because she's about to get soaked because it usually keeps the water. We'll just have to fill it up a lot more. That's another problem because the water is going back into the, the saw area. Whatever, we have water, right? We don't yeah. have off or anything? Yeah. You look like a DJ. Yeah. This is such a good song. Woo, where are we? Back in. And for my beloved tile cutter, AG1 is our sidekick. Let's finish this year strong and hit the next with long-term goals that are attainable. AG1 by Athletic Greens makes it easy to build healthy habits that have longevity. One scoop, a little bit of H2O, and bam, 75 vitamins, minerals, and more. Step three, down it and you have your nutritional insurance. So much of what your body needs to recover, focus, energize, and function at its best. Doubles as a microphone. We felt the amazing benefits since discovering AG1. It's the perfect pick me up when you need a boost and I feel happy inside knowing I'm doing good things for my body. It's an easy and convenient decision you can make every day to care for yourself. And we all know that it's that time of year where we start looking for that magic fix. Well, AG1 by Athletic Greens is the closest thing to magic. 
When you head on down to the description and click the link, you'll see they're offering you a free one year supply immune supporting vitamin D and five free travel packs with your first purchase. There we go. First piece. First row. Wow, we're done first row. <gasps> Crushing it. Crushing it. Okay. Next. Next. We are lying out our towels to see towels. Wow. Tiles. We are lying out our tiles to see what they look like and get a hang of cutting and placing before we mix up the mortar and start doing it for reals. I cannot wait to see this and we cannot wait to show you the finished product. It's going to look so good. I'm already getting hyped. I'm hyped. From a couple pieces of tile. It's going to look good. Ooh la la. I'm stoked. Do you want to know what to do when the mortar has to set for 10 minutes? Smashed potato time. These are boiled whole potatoes smashed and baked in the oven. That oh. was so good. We made like 10 the other day so that we could have the opportunity to heat these up because they're delicious. How good? Mm -hmm. Yeah, the last mix. I have to say I'm having such a grand time tiling. It looks amazing already. This space is going to be phenomenal and it's finished and I'm in almost complete disbelief that we're here I was very intimidated by the bathroom and the fact that we're at this step makes me very very proud and very happy and I can't wait we've gotten this far this cabin will be perfect in its own imperfect way <laughs> What tile are we on? Last tile. Yay! I'm going loopy looking at this floor. <laughs> Boom! It looks so good and it's not even grounded. I love it. I'm so happy. It's so pretty. You can't really tell, but it looks like cement. Sits for 24 hours. So we let this sit for 24 hours and tomorrow will be another big day. Grouting? Grouting and making the shower, I would say. <laughs> Here goes nothing. Wanna go relax? Yes, please. I'm working real hard all day. Come on, girls. Come on, girls. Woo! Woo! Will you pee on me some birch? Doing good. The <laughs> contrast from the outside to the inside is nuts. It's so warm. Ooh. Good job keeping it stoked. Thank you. It's definitely worth it. As soon as the fire had some hot coals, it was super easy. Just had to remember. Put another log in. Twenty-three hours and fifty-nine minutes and fifty-nine seconds. Twenty-four hours. <laughs> we just realized we're using a lot of new terms that we actually just got familiar with, and we're assuming all of you know. So grout is what goes in between your tiles. That will ensure it's one hundred percent waterproof, and no water will get through the cracks. However, grout actually isn't waterproof. That's why you don't want a tile underneath your shower. Waterproofing the bathroom was actually the most intimidating part for me, just because there's so much different information out there. But I think we probably overdid it. But what makes the bathroom waterproof is first red guard, second mortar, then the third layer is Dietra. After the Dietra, we then put on more mortar, more mortar, this is hard. And then on top of that goes the tile. And now, the finishing touches of the grout. We're almost there, everyone. Making a bathroom waterproof. 
is a very long process because we are not good enough for fast set mortar yet. We tried, it was not fun. The good thing about this grout is that compared to everything else that we've used, all of the products we've used, it's not a 24 hour set time. It's actually rapid set, which means we can be walking on it within three hours. Does it look good? So good. I'm very, very happy with it. I'm excited for these next steps. Light up, ignition, take a ride on the skyline. Let's get some screwdrivers and some pre drills. In the rest of the list, so we don't have to keep walking out. Let's do it. cabin in beautiful summer days. Gotta save it for days like today. To attach the base and for the success of the rest of the shower, we need to create studs at three points on this side and three points on that side. Beginning, middle, and end. the first time it's very challenging it's a lot of problem solving and reading and figuring things out but i'm feeling very accomplished already even though it's not done it's coming along this is gonna sound crazy but i think that the color of these walls is giving me a headache no it's too tall it's too tall no, gonna... <laughs> how are we doing boss seems to be pretty good Love to hear it. We are steps away from being shower owners. <laughs> Not users. Shower! Door frame assembly. This is what this is looking like every second, everyone. There's not many moves happening right now. Even Bella's getting over this. Ready, come. In my hand. Hand. Good girl. Go. These just make actually next to no sense. I gotta say, you stay very calm. Just and smile. Just don't get it. <laughs> <laughs> Some homemade Mac. Thank you. To make you smile. This fresh to share. Pardon? This fresh to share. That's all yours, honey. <laughs> we are on the last page. We're doing it! We're almost there. I think we figured it out. This was probably one of the more challenging projects recently. The rush of emotions is a sign of accomplishment. After long hours and hard work, we did it together. Nice. Nice. That was really impressed. That was like the best part yet. It's cool we know how to do this though. Like we're gonna go now. Learn a skill, retain it. It's square! Oh, it looks amazing. Like we did it, everyone! Yes, finally! 
<laughs> this means so much because that means within a few weeks we're gonna have a fully functional space in here that will transform. Like, I'm so grateful to be at this point, really. I'm bringing the hose in here. Right now? See you all Sunday. We love ya. Love you, Pat. Ciao. Pause up. <laughs> <laughs>